What about this PTR changes real quick? Um, this, I don't know if this changes like the damage, but if he's 140 damage with his frag launcher, it's actually gonna be pretty damn good against them. Um, it's gonna break shield so much faster. Okay, this change, I know a lot of people are really, like really think it's like a big deal. I, don't, I actually, okay, I think this is a buff. Okay, maybe I'm crazy. I'm probably crazy, I don't play Lucio. But this change, it's pretty nuts. And this change is pretty irrelevant. And this change is relevant. The 10% speed nerf here is pretty relevant, but you almost never amp Most Lucios, I don't think ever, they rarely ever amp speed. You generally, you speed in and then you amp heal. Or you like, you, you amp speed at the very, very start and then you go to amp heal. A lot of the time, at least, this is what Neptune taught me. He says he uses 90% of his amps on odd heals. Because amp heals is what keeps you alive in goats. So I don't think this is actually that significant. Uh, this, who cares? This, who cares? This, who cares? This change, don't know why they nerfed Zaya. Zaya is a symptom, not a problem. Zaya is not a problematic hero. I don't know why they nerfed it. This change, 30% to 25%. I don't think this changes anything. I don't think this changes goats at all. There's a point that the that Nox made on Twitter that like the only reason Zen Goats exist is because Zen Goats count as regular Moira Goats. If you play any sort of dive comp, more regular Moira Goats is generally better against that dive comp. So I don't think this fixes anything. Even if Zen Goats dies, then you just play Moira Goats into dive and then dive kind of gets shit on by it. So I don't think it's gonna don't think it's gonna change much. I don't know how it works. What's, um, where's my fucking pocket calculator? So what is 46 times by 1.3, 59.8 versus 48 times by 1.25, 60, which was bigger. So you actually do, you actually do more damage now than you did before, right? What about on headshot? Let's do, let's do uh, 90. So let's do 92 times by 1.3. 119.6. Okay, then that'll be what? One, it'll be 96 times by 1.25. So, yeah, it's more, you actually do more damage now than you did previous. Which is interesting. They round up. Oh, if they round up, then it's the same, right? I don't know. More goats could be even more rest and sleeper than, than, uh, than Zen goats. But yeah, I don't know. This, these PTR changes feel like super super insignificant like it just feels bad five percent less team damage yeah that's that's definitely the bigger changes compare i go to one of the most advanced comps in the game what's that face Ooh. i mean again it's like it's low individual skill but it's very high team play and coordination so huh. i don't know again zen nerfs are always a weird one of like Yes, it does nerf goats, and it also in the same same token doesn't nerf goats. So I still think it's like honestly just like a fundamental game mechanical problem is is what is causing goats to exist. Like like angry times in EU specifically were playing a lot of quad, a lot of quad tank like way before goats meta, and like they were having a lot of success because they kind of like like I still think quad tank would still be like nuts against the uh, still be nuts in the current meta. In that better today, I. Uh, bought like the power line adapter kind of shit, so...